Hi, I'm Anita Griffin. Um, I'm the rehearsal director for the production of Caravaggio. Um, Darshan and I worked together many years ago with London Contemporary Dance Theatre. When Darshan said that he needed to have some props made for, the, for Caravaggio, um, he was talking about having some false legs made, so I put him in touch with um, Nick Barnes, who is part of uh, Blind Summit, one of the directors of Blind Summit. Uh, one of the other things I've been helping Darshan with um, is uh, with taking some photographs of the dancers and doing their headshots really for the programme. My name is Lisa Wellham, I am 29 years old. I trained at the Northern School of Contemporary Dance, uh, graduated in 2002. I joined Phoenix Dance Theatre and Darshan was the director. Um, I think within the process of Caravaggio, um, Darshan gives us maybe a basis of movement and then we're able to develop it and um, however it feels right to develop within the character, he allows us to do that so there's definitely a lot of freedom um, within the movement. Uh, my name is Renaud Weiser, I'm um, Swiss. I was born in Lausanne and um, I trained in, in Geneva. I came to uh, London and I started working for a Rambert Dance Company. I worked there for five years, uh, did a lot of touring and that's where I um, met Darshan for the first time. Uh, we did a piece called Stand and Stare. In this piece my role is to be, I am um, uh, part of a love triangle really. Um, I am a young man who is involved with uh, a young woman and we meet uh, Car Caravaggio uh, at a party and we start developing some kind of a relationship. I become a model for Caravaggio and slowly uh, it goes a little bit further than just working together. We, we then start a romantic relationship, but Caravaggio is also attracted to my um, girlfriend and then the relationship becomes a lot more messy. I started Aerial uh, with wall running in harnesses um, about 10 years ago with a lovely lady called Lindsay Butcher. For Caravaggio, um, we've had an idea of having silks, of which at the top top point of the silks there's a cocoon, of which I make an ascent up. So it's the last part of the piece, pretty much, where uh, Caravaggio is basically going to die. Um, but the way that I've kind of layered it is, is that he has a gradual ascent up to his deathbed, of which is in a cocoon. A uh, cocoon is like a slack uh, piece of fabric, of which you can move and manipulate and, and be within. Um, yeah, so, and, and then just trying to find lots of different textures from the piece, um, different sections that I can bring onto the fabric so that it doesn't just become about the tricks and, um, uh, you know, the drops and the da-da aspects of um, Ariel. My name is Eki Maas and I'm a director of Millennium Performing Arts, a three-year full-time theatre training course in Woolwich, South East London. Well, I'm John B. Reid, lighting designer, and this is um, a wonderful experience for me because it means I'm working on a small show with a small rig, but it has to be superbly defined. We need to have very, very special lights for this production. And I've worked with Darshan before, so it's, for me it's a great pleasure to work with him again. And we open the show in Nottingham and we'll see how it goes. It will be refined, then hopefully we will get more performances, we'll bring it into town, that would be absolutely wonderful. Darshan has been a consultant to our contemporary dance course here at Millennium since its inception right back in 1997. And so Darshan has been an integral part of the school, uh, really advising and uh, teaching in the school over the years. This particular project was an interesting project for us to be involved with because I have some interesting students who could really benefit from looking at a professional company 
and how a professional company works and, and how it uh, operates and uh, uh, a rehearsal project for a full-length piece, uh, how that might come together. Um, and that's why it was interesting to invite Darshan and his company to our studios here to allow them to do the work here and uh, help with that project. Darshan's company helped our school and our students.